hard grind, no rest. I'm the best, I'm the really in my zone. We appreciate you, uh, uh, Lady Buck. But you the tech because guy. You... How you sitting here? Don't tell nobody shit. Oh yeah, I guess that's the first like a love and lose it because uh, <laughs> I heard it. I'm here and I messed up. <laughs> uh. But um yeah, I this guess they I guess they need to they they need to uh like a little love and lose me. No, this some bullshit right here. All right, girl. Lady Bug, you ready? I'm ready. Let's go. All right, let's go. Let's just get into this shit right here. This is the summer. Let's go. Let us know if you guys like Love It or Lose It. All right, so do we like Love It or Lose It? That was Summer. Um, let us know what you guys think. Studio Bug. I am never a fan of the auto-tune, but this was kind of all right. Um, could be a little bit better, but I'm not not ready to hate on it. So I'm going to just give it a, a, a like. That's all it gets for me. Like. All right, Ladybug. I liked it, but what is he talking about? Ten tones down, ten toes down. What is he saying? Something about the ten toes. The only, the only reason why I know a nigga would be ten toes down is for only like three reasons. Okay, <laughs> two of those reasons are not fucking good. Okay, it could have had a little more dynamics to it, you know. Ten toes down in the winter. Okay. In the winter. So uh, Wayne says on YouTube that it has a dope hook, a fire hook. I like it. All right. So um, this is called Love All Your Wine. Let us know if you guys like Love It or Lose It. A crew, the alpha, when Macaulay girl them awesome. All right, y'all, so this is the IAS Live Music Review. We just heard another track from an independent artist. Let us know if you guys like Love It or Lose It. Ladybug. Ooh. Ooh. Mm-hmm. So what that mean? Ooh. Ooh. I don't want to say lose it, but we're going to have to give some debits here. I'm going to put out some debits here. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Right. Mm. All right. Producer, engineer, or the artist? <laughs> I might have to blame. Actually, I'm going to blame the artist on this one. Just just, just my opinion. Um, you know, I think the, the hook could have, you know, they, they could have did something with it, you know, or like a, like a call and answer. Move. 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 Right. Move. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I'm just trying to figure out the concept of the, of, of the record and where it can go to be a little more, maybe commercial or. I don't think that there's anything in the song that I didn't like that was stopping me from loving it. I just personally didn't love it. I don't know how to express that, but, um, I think that he did what he was supposed to do in the song. All right, so just so you know, because you've been here for with us, I, he acted brand new. How? And it's, you, you be. How? Drink sweet. your tea. Drink your tea. I was sipping. Sip your shit. Sip. Sipping. Sip, sip. Sip. The fuck sip. So what happens is, is that we want to make sure that artists understand, understand why and how to connect with their fans or potential fans 
or people who are looking for new sounds and new brands. That's what we're doing. Correct? Cool. All right. Sip. Sip. I, sip. I have to sip again? Sip. A sip. double sip? Sip. Sip, sip. Okay. Now, with that said, it's not enough just to tell the artist, oh, I like now, it. If the artist is watching and he heard me from the other times that I was on the show, I think he is communicating with me and he understands what I'm saying. Like, this is not a, uh, it's a good, catchy song. He probably could come up with something as an artist that's a better song. But for, like, what this is, this is just that one baby. It's just that one song that he was like, all right, this is just a vibe. I so, got you. And it's so just you what like it, it. Is. It's not, it. Not every song is supposed to be a 10. This song is just a, a 7. I totally agree with you. Not every song we're going to like. Not every song everybody is going to like. I got you. And that's why we actually tell artists and encourage artists to keep submitting music because you may have an EP of seven songs. You may have an album of 20 songs. Submit all of them. Prime example. Exactly what he said. But let's not, let's not overlook the fact. You just said, if you know me, you've been here, you've seen other shows with me. Because he's been here before. But now he wants to come today and he wants to act brand new with the dumb shit. So we got to rectify what? that. It's okay. It's all Abuse. right. Abuse. It's not. Why is it abuse? I say my opinion and I get abuse. I just want to know why you I, don't I'm love say, it. I, I don't. You like it. Why didn't ask why, why I didn't don't hate you it? love it? Why didn't ask why I didn't hate it? Which I don't mean, love it. I'm, I'm not. Look. I know why you don't this hate it. With this particular song, all I'm saying is that he reached the limit of it. There's no reason for me that, or, or I could give him insight to make it any better for it to be a love for me. It's just a yeah. like. This song right here is just a like. It's a good like. So if you want me to give you numbers, it's a 7 or an 8. In my SB, opinion, it'll what? never be a 10. Oh, shit. It'll never be a 10. What the fuck is he talking about? That don't mean wait that the song is wait a, minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. It's not a 10. Maybe it's not reaching me. It's not a 10 right now. What can he do or he or she or the writer can do or the engineer or the producer can do to make it a 10? Give me your insight because you've been in the business for 20 plus years. Stop fucking playing with us. Give us the give us the jewels. Okay, lose the reggae vibe and make it hip-hop, so I love it. For what? L lose the reggae vibe. Make it hip-hop, and then I love it. It's not for you to love. We're talking about the consensus. You just said, you just said. The I, consensus. Okay, well, the consent. I don't know how to answer this question. I'm done. I feel like I've answered it. I'm done. Has uh, Lady, but, uh, uh, are you, am I clear to you at least was what I'm saying? I, I was asking you a question. What word rhymes with move? <laughs> a chew. Like how it was cold in here earlier. That's why I'm drinking this tea. <laughs> yeah. I think this was the same artist that had the shoes in a decar on some oh. other track. Yeah. Okay. And, and and it was hard to decipher it's on what was going on. It's the simple things in life. The <laughs> shoes into the car. The friends who are enemies. I like the shirt in the closet. All right. This is Studio Bug from BX Records. Please plug in the site. Plug in everything. Yo, go to BX Underground, and we got stuff up there for you. I'm done with him and everything that's going on with the bullshit <laughs> on this other shit. I cannot do it. I cannot do no more than what the fuck I'm doing. I can't. I cannot. All right. We're going to get into this next joint. Um, And I'm really, I heard this song. I usually do not listen to the songs that are submitted to us prior to the show. But this song I did hear. I heard it multiple times. And I'm really want, I really want to know what the two bugs got to say. So we definitely want you to tell the artist what you think, your feedback, and give the artist the truth. This particular track, this is called God's Plan. I just stopped praying. I got a gun. Yeah, yeah, where the bottle at? Right, pass that shit, man. You got a plan for me? 
I done seen a lot of shit I done sold a lot of drugs I done lost a lot of crips All I thought about was getting rich I bought a hundred grams and got a stick If it's his guard plan, he done fucked up I'm from the jungle where you pray if you ain't tough enough I be back to grip, and then I call this bluff I ain't saying that was tough, I just ain't give a fuck Dark Knight's big gun? I'm like, give it up. Give it. Buddy, he was claiming crip. Guess he wasn't crip enough. Yeah. Not jam, mine's didn't. Guess he wasn't quick enough. Dang. Told me he was playing tough. Dang. Niggas had to pick him up. I put your shooters in a box. I ain't a boxer. I keep a knocker. I pop a bean and I go bonkers. God's plan, made my mama give me up. Sometimes I wonder why my mama ain't give a fuck. God got a plan for me. Get up. For me. Yeah. Red pill, blue pill, so hard to give it up. I'll be in the box until I die before I give you up. God's plan took my people when the slaves. My whole housewife, they put me in a cage. I done sniffed so much coke, I can't give it up. I done drank too much lean, I can't give it up. I done fucked all that pussy, I can't give it up. I chase money every day, I never give it up. What? Yo, free my streets. Yeah. Uh, free psych bike. Yeah. You been there a long time, cuz. I'm free. Yo, yo, yo. I watch family. Free land. Turn on family. Yo. And I watch strangers. Love me more. Six niggas, six minutes. I'm in the shit until the shit finish. Big Crip, new whip, you see the rim spinning. My team spinning, my little cousin Big Bremen. Yeah, mad that I'm a G in my wrist slitty. Play me next pick, I might have your bitch with me. I was told never snitch, shoulda follow me. Niggas switch up, pop shit and give apologies. Perky at the perky, thick bitch sit on top of me. Birdie at the birdie on the block, this Monopoly. I'll pull his birdie in the desert, niggas flock at me. Honey pack, Henny bitch, trust me, ain't no stopping me. I got dreams of dead people on top of me. Shoot mine, shoot two of yours, that's for so I, I suppose they want me to begin. Who the fuck is they? You. <laughs> so I'll begin. This is good. It's good, and yes, I do. I do like it. It's very uh, Nipsey uh, hustle type situation. So I'm going to give it a love. I'm gonna give it a love. So no, I, I love it. I'm gonna give I'm gonna give it a love. Why? Why? Because he had a he had a good message that he wanted to say and he, he conveyed it in a good way. And um Yeah, he chose a nice style that he that he was comfortable with it. And I just like it. I just love it. Ladybug? I this song is a very you? powerful song. Uh, I I I would love it if the artist would have put a singer on it to do the hook. Um, because the song is, the, the words and the lyrics, even the music is, is very compelling. Put a singer on it to really make the song pop. I hear that DMX influence all the way throughout the song. So, and that's just vocal, that's just vocal tone. He's not doing it on purpose, right? That that's right. for fact. I got from the message very clear. He was doing lean. He was doing cocaine. I said, God damn. I said, Lord have mercy. And he made it through. And I like that. The fact that he was able to say it, what I call unapologetic. And and I'm gonna say this a hundred thousand percent, one over in ten. The irony of it all. My mama. He's trying to fucking play me in the background, but you see, I got him on a motherfucking rewind. What? What the fuck? What you do? What? I don't understand the comment of over one hundred and 
over. What was that? We'll do the rewind. Yeah. I said, but ultimately, the irony of it all. Mm hmm. Yeah. So it's like the good and the bad. It's like the, the message that I'm giving you is a sad story, but it's progress. So you don't know it until you're in it, and then you realize you're like, oh shit. So you think it's fucked up, but then it's light. Am I lying? Am I am I off? No, 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 you're right. Hmm? You're right. So then why were you doing the motherfucking side face and the gas face behind me? Again, because you did some numerical breakdown and I was trying to understand that part because it was just so out of my scope at the moment. I was like, who? How many how many masters? I need to kneel the grassy over here to figure and understand what where you need, going with it. You need a you need a divine institute. Yeah. To break. Yeah. <laughs> Help me, please, <laughs> because I'm like six quattro. Anyway, that's so fucked up, but it's so special, and I love it. I love you. I love, I love it. <laughs> All right, if you guys don't know, <sighs> this is Linda. Excuse you. Move, move to the side. It's kind of hard because... This is Linda. This is Linda. Lisa. Linda. Uh, if you haven't rolled with us for quite some time, get get the background check on Linda, Lisa. You see... You I don't see, like her. She's tatted. She's tatted all yes. around. She's tatted. My name is there. <laughs> don't play. All right. Right. I don't I don't like chicks with weaves though. So what, what you mean? This one here, yo. She alright, she cool. She don't disrespect me or nothing like that, you know. But you know, she can't get my number. All I'm right, y'all. So if you guys want to submit your music for the IAS Live Music Review Show, you can at our website at IASLiveMusicReview.com or for any live show, just email it to us. Same same what? Same call to action, just at gmail.com. There you go. Is the consensus that you guys love the last song or you guys like the last song? I, 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 I'm I, telling you, I really do love it. I just wish they would have had a singer on it. And who do you give the credit to? The artist, the producer, or the engineer? I'm not going to lie. I'm going to give the credit to the artist in this case for a, an exceptional work, well done. And even though... He, it, I don't want to compare him to DMX because I think he has his own story and his own testimony. And I thought it cut real good through in the record. And I could feel I could feel the, the sincerity in the vocal. The Go sincerity. On. The believability. Yeah. Producer. Why? <laughs> Just to be controversial. That's... You don't get no more respect. What I said was what I said. It was good. It was great. And I loved it. But you don't get that oh. I believe in you, bro. And you should have been here to join us in the chat room to tell us what's the deal. And so we take this show, we cut and edit for television across the states, the United States. Are we across, like, are we across the pond yet? Are we? Are we? Are we? Are we? Are we? Are we? <laughs> <laughs> I can't quote it at this point, yo. Yo, your hands are mad cold. Hence why I try to ask for the tea. <laughs> Thank you. <so. laughs> I do. IAS Live Music Review. We are more than just music reviews. Believe you don't fuck it. You don't, don't fucking believe me. Don't believe shit. Don't believe nothing. See for yourself. Do your own research. Do your own research. We what? here to push our own propaganda. What? what the Higher. Fuck? Wait, what? Higher. <laughs> Higher music. Higher. Play the music loud. No, that's not what 
what the fuck we're doing? We we're not doing anything of what the fuck he just said prior to my speaking. I'm crying. I'm crying. I thought that was, cool. I thought that was the goal. No, I'm crying. <laughs> we eat the tears of the artist. <laughs> Yes. Straighten up, straighten up. No, nigga, fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Lady one, get him the fuck out of here. It's over. It's fucking done. Get, get the fuck out of here. We're going to be on IAS live. We're going to be on IAS. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. On the gram, baby. On the gram. Lady Bug, please tell them, please. Please. Check us out. <laughs> Look, nine o'clock. I hear slide music review on the gram. No, it's Tune IAS in. music. It's IAS music. None of y'all know the address. Nobody can give the right yeah, address. IAS music. Nobody can give me anything. Nobody. Doobie doobie doo. Be do be do be. I is it. Do be do be do. Happy Thanksgiving, do be.